from the earth through the body, a small vibration like an earthquake. Shoulders are loose, head is loose, neck is soft, arms hanging from the shoulder blades, from the collarbones, feeling the width of the upper back. And during this shaking of your living water bag, on occasions, there appears a hole inside this water bag, and the water spurts out any direction. It can also spurt out of the legs. Yes, any timing. The pressure from inside this water bag causes the spurt to happen quickly. Nice. Beautiful. And gradually this small vibrating earthquake comes to a stop. You can imagine the Dantian jumping around to cause this, this vibration. You can also imagine the shadow behind you, shaking the body, moving you up and down. You can also imagine this string, the string from your personal star, shaking up and down, suspended between the head and the tail, imagining your tail string attached to the central core of the earth, tied with all of the other tail strings in the universe. Thank you, Adam. And now we'll begin an impulse from the rib cage. Impulse comes from the center back, just behind around the 12th thoracic vertebra, pushing the rib cage forward. Body responds, falling forward. And then an impulse comes from the sternum, pushing the body back into alignment. Spine realigning, vertebra stacking. Same thing happens from the front. From the sternum, pushing to the back. Body responds. Re reacting to the push, falling forward then back, another impulse from the back pushes the spine back successionally into alignment. So without the pushes, forward, body reacts, realigning Body realigns, pushing back. Body reacts, pushing forward into alignment. And then this becomes a wave moving forward to backwards. Forward. This wave, arms just go along for the ride, knees are soft. This wave can increase in tempo and size, can change size or tempo. Moving forward or back, it becomes a wave. This can also happen in the hips. Hips moving forward, body reacting. Hips moving back into alignment. Body realigning, rolling up. Body pushes back from the hips, from the pelvis. Dantian, responding spine, pushing back into alignment. Same thing, 
can become a wave. Going forward and backwards, feeling the pelvis tipping under and back. This wave can become faster, smaller, larger, increasing, feeling the knees and ankles also reacting. This can also happen to the sides, pushing, body reacting, coming back from a side push into the straight alignment, recovering, pushing side, body react, pushing back into alignment. Same thing can happen back and forth, side to side, becoming a wave. The body constantly tries to rebalance itself. Can increase and decrease size and tempo can also happen on a diagonal, same thing. I'll just demonstrate the wave. Keep the knees soft. So the body has room to react. Can happen on both diagonals. can also begin to happen as a circle. Torso can circle. Body is rebalancing itself either direction. These can also happen in the pelvis. Circling diagonals. Side to side. Feeling the soft knees. Can change directions. Can begin to move the Dantian from low, circling, up, to high circling. Imagine that Dantian circling on a horizontal plane, moving up and back down again into the pelvis, with the body continually rebalancing itself. Circling, arms hanging, Dantian moving up and down in the torso, creating reactions through the spine, through the rib cage, through the pelvis. You can also use your image of your shadow behind you, moving hands up and down. The string above you, swirling in a spiral, creating a spiral reaction in your body. 